out and there we go Saijima first. I know I have to level him up uh, a lot. I think more than the others. I think. I did a good amount with the cop and whatnot. There's no side quest for him? I thought there was. I got nothing on him. Okay, that's got to change. Time to go to the drugstore and get a whole bunch of drugs. Gotta get drugs! Actually, I could go to the good drugstore now. I think I shouldn't worry. I have trash on me. from all the other characters, so, oh yeah, I got a lot of trash on me. Alright, well, I know what I'm doing. something up there. What? No. Appraise everything. What? Oh. Oh, he did. 
get a freeze over here. Okay. See, this would be nice to have right here. Dragon Fleck Vest. Uh, probably gonna go come back and freeze them as anything instantly. Ancient Steel, no. That's a lot of points. If I remember correctly, I have to punch the balls or just block. I don't remember exactly, but I'll figure it out. last night because of the lack of maidens to wake you up. Hey, yo! <laughs> uh, it do be like that sometimes. <laughs> My failure in gaining maidens. saying it was wrong. Uh, when you think about it, that sign was lying on the ground. I bet it used to be somewhere else. I get it. So we gotta look for the place it used to be originally. Bingo. Hold on. Hey, Sajima. Look. Another book. Another one. Let's see. 
Uh, your rock killing skills are remarkable? Yes. <laughs> this one's about martial arts too. Uh, this technique will come in handy. Two in a row. That's funny. Could be some sort of clue. Uh, if we find more, it might mean that there's some kind of link to that thing your old man left behind. Yeah, I reckon. Wait a second. Could that hole be... Nani. I knew it. Uh, the sign was set there. Uh, so, breaking this rock will open up the path to the air raid shelter? <laughs> Number two, then. Then it's settled. We try digging here next. Oh, when you got the time, of course. No sweat. I'm just glad I got my hands on this book. Undarm attack power increase. Come back whenever you can. I'll see you to the entrance. My training is not complete yet. I must learn the ways. I must learn everything. Yes. This room sounded nice. I was playing as Kiryu uh, the day before yesterday. It was great, Rag, playing as Kiryu. And then, uh, you know, doing R1 triangle, tiger drop. <laughs> Even though I didn't use it much, but I was doing it. Neither heaven or earth for I alone in the sugar coating one. Imaginary technique, tiger drop. I will find out. Wrong one. There we go. Central Park. Now. Where is Central Park? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's like right around here. No. I'll find out. It doesn't matter. I'm just trying to go to a drugstore. Oh, it's this parking lot. That parking lot. Imaginary technique, yes, the imaginary technique. Tiger drop. <laughs> and I just bought, like, uh, what's it called? On Steam, they were having a sale for a crisis for uh, remastered games. I bought all three of them for, like, what was it? Like, almost. I think it was, like, 20 something bucks. And that was it. For all three. On Steam. I was like, huzzah, I saved money. I can't wait to replay those games again, because I liked all of them. That's trash! It's my trash now. What the hell is this one? Singing Filipino mm -hmm. song. Ooh. Speaking Thai along. She ain't speaking Japanese. Oh shit. What should I do? Make up a random word. Yes! <laughs> I'll just take my chances. Attempting to speak in Tagalog. Oh, actually speaking Tagalog. Speaking Tagalog. I made her cry. What did I do? Oh no, what have I done? <laughs> I'm just gonna leave. Man made her cry on accident. It's fucking great. Got the good stuff. Literally me. <laughs> yeah, I just bought all those <laughs> for a cheap price. <laughs> mm, I need 
need to figure out a good way to train. Hmm. Now that I could, oh, it is combined with everyone's equipment. Would you look at that? Even shows right there, Kiryu, Akiyama, Saijima, and Tanamura. Tenji approves of the consumption of unknown drugs. Add that to the lore. <laughs> you see what happened was. <laughs> oh, I, I forgot I'm level 6 on this guy. I mean, I, I leveled up several times. Uh, let me get the essence moves. Eh? That would be the smart thing. Knockback. And escape from tight situation, guard and knock away an enemy, charging me, charging tackle, triple charging finish. Let's get all the level twos. Nia grabbed the enemy with an extra force. Charging long enough allows for a double triple charge finishing. Oh, that's cool. I need a lot of XP. I am at 6,000. I need to get to 15,000. Oh god! The police! I gotta escape the popo! No! Please! I'm not the man you're looking for! <laughs> Leave me alone, I'm just a hobo. Looks like I outran him. <laughs> I forgot I gotta worry about the police with Saijima. <laughs> I forgot about that. Shit, I didn't think about that. Why you always run? I didn't do nothing, officer. I didn't do nothing. I swear. <laughs> Holy shit. All right, all right. That's it. That's it. You done messed up, AA Ron. That's it. I had enough of this bullshit. Get the hell off me. You're all gonna die! happening here
Why wouldn't he just roll it? sure to do damage him from the start <laughs> smoking that pack with this one. Yeah! He just brought out a log, started sculpting, and then all of a sudden, boom! <laughs> I gained a revelation about a motorcycle from a man dying. <laughs> soon enough anyway. You don't look like a guy who lives dangerously, but I ain't one to judge a tiger by its stripes. Oh, what's eating you? I appreciate your concern. You see, I work at a jewelry shop, or I used to. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Until he got robbed the other day. These hardcore dudes came in, pointed their guns at me, and said, hand over the jewels if you want to live. Of course I wanted to live, so I hand over the jewels. Did I ever? I, I opened all the display cases, then my manager got ballistic, so now he runs over, sticks a knife to my throat, and guess what he says? Get back to Jules if you want to live. <coughs> I'm pretty sure the shop was just the front for the Yakuza. I saw a murder in my manager's eyes. Uh, eyes, I can tell you that. So I filed a police report and even did some investigating of my own. Found out the gateway car was seen heading for these docks. 
but nobody's seen anything, and now I'm stuck on a wild goose chase. Even if I fi uh, did find the guys, they'd probably just give, uh, just kill me on the spot. It's too depressing to even think about. <clears throat> That's why I figure I should just get over with and die on my own terms. Poor guy, getting caught up in a bunch of Yakuza bullshit. Listen, buddy. If you're capable of offing yourself, I'd say you're capable of a damn near anything. <clears throat> that That's a line. That that was a line that I heard. <laughs> that was a line I heard. <laughs> I will remember that for next time if someone's going to just uh, self-delete. <laughs> if, <you're, laughs> if you're capable of offing yourself, you're capable of anything. <laughs> <laughs> that is inspiring words. <laughs> Instead of giving up the ghost, try digging in your heels. Even if you can't do much on your own, you ought to be able to hire a private eye or something. You know what? You're right. This man makes a terrible negotiator. <laughs> exactly. You know what? You're right. I guess I've been feeling guilty about now <clears throat> not putting up a fight. But I think I'll keep at it, and try to find those jewels, once I stop feeling so depressed, that is. Alright, <clears throat> good luck to you. He's got balls for, uh, Sivvy. Uh, so there's jewel thieves on the run around here. Huh, I ought to see what I can find. <coughs> Doing some fishing around here, pal? Huh? Uh, yeah, more or less. Uh, well, if you really want to reel in a good haul, you better off trying a different spot. Why is that? I do my share of fishing here myself, but they just aren't biting like they used to. I've wound up reeling in more random junk than fish. Uh, there's a better fishing spot a little ways away. I'd be happy to show you where. Nah, I'm good. Ought to be able to catch plenty for you, one fella. How about you? Huh, why are you fishing here? Uh, if it's so crappy. Truth be told, I'm not really into for the fish. I just like the view. It's a journey that matters to me, not the destination. That's so. And I guess the two of us, our anglers, can suck it up and enjoy the ride. Oh, uh, yep. <coughs> you got that right. What am I gonna ask around at the docks? I wonder. <coughs> now I wonder. Dun 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 dun. Are you a fishing enthusiast too? So you gotta reload the area. Hmm. That's the taxi driver. Unless... <clears throat> this could be the only thing I could think of. I have to buy bait. Really? I don't want to buy bait. Give me the cheapest bait you got.
already screwed up. Lovely. for the biscuit! It's very heavy. <clears throat> okay, well, I tried. <laughs> Best attempt. Picks it all up. It's like, yeah. Kiryu needs a whole tool just to do that. Uh, I need to get one lower. going on? Come on, give us back what you stole already. <laughs> Femme fatale, uh oh. <clears throat> Don't even think about it. Try to run. Hey, what are you doing? Huh? None of your business. What's it to you anyway? Get lost. Well, didn't expect this to happen. 
I'm about to make it my business. For a bunch of men in suits, this don't look too gentlemanly. Uh, please help me. Not so fast. You, I thought I told you to get lost. It's clear as a kappa you're up to some shady shit. Uh, which isn't your problem, so beat it already. When someone asks me for help, it becomes my problem. Especially when they're surrounded by a bunch of suits. Great, <clears throat> we gotta wanna be hero. Look, this is one damsel in distress you don't wanna save. Meddle in our business and there will be real consequences. Not another BDMS girl. <laughs> uh, that a threat? No, it's a promise. Playing hero for some woman you've never even met uh, will get you killed. <clears throat> hey, dumbass, hello in there. Uh, I guess you're ignoring my warning. Huh. Yes, I am. Then you painted us into a corner. Try not to get your blood on my suit. I think it's gonna be the opposite. just got that dry cleaned. <laughs> uh, your bark sure is worse than your bite. Thank you. Uh, my name is Sayori. And you are? Uh, uh, Suzuki. Well, thank you, Suzuki-san. Well, lucky me, getting saved by some such a manly hero. I'm glad chivalry isn't dead. What's up with these suits, anyhow? Uh, yapping about you stealing from him? <laughs> uh, that's not important. Uh, but speak speaking of your heroism, I wonder if I could ask you for one more teensy little favor. I don't like where this is going. Hey, yo. Oh, I thought you pulled out a badge. Oh, the undercover cop. Would you take this CD-ROM to a man waiting in the subway tunnel, then bring me the briefcase he hands off to you. Uh, what's a rum? Uh, uh, that what you stole? Uh, yes. Uh, that shiny plate got some kind of value or what? More than you can imagine. Uh, it's what's inside that counts. Oh, yeah. I don't get it. You don't have to believe me to help me. <clears throat> I'll compensate you too. Will you do this for me? I saw a lady in trouble and stepped in to help. That's it. Don't want nothing to do with your CD-ROM schemes. <laughs> uh, do what you like, but if you ask me, this kind of business is way too risky for a woman. Uh, now you're being sexist. <laughs> you're the one that got surrounded by like five dudes. It seems I can't persuade you then. Seems that way. Fine. And I'll go by myself, alone. But please, if anything happens to me... No, never mind. Alright, I suppose this is it. Farewell. Bye! Saved you? No, leave. <clears throat> I went on. No more involvement. All I wanted to do was kick some A's. Shit, I went the wrong way.
Mm-hmm. Or you the man said, nah, fuck your side quest. Yeah. What's this machine with electric chair and more importantly, who are you? My name is <clears throat> uh Mida. Of course. I'm actually pretty famous depending on which neck of the woods you're in. And this, my friend, is the Inner Fighter 7 Revolution, or IF7R for short. IF7R. <laughs> IF7R is an arcade machine of the future. I invented it. <laughs> I don't get it. How can a machine be a game? <clears throat> this just looks like a fancy torture device. How rude. Yeah, this machine is the invention of the century. The IF7R provides the ultimate arcade experience. It allows realistic battles in a virtual world. I got absolutely no idea what this guy is talking about. <laughs> uh, just give it a try and you'll understand. One game is 10,000 yen. Anybody can play as long as they have the dough. I don't know what this thing does and I can't see a reason to spend that much money on a machine. Think about it the other way around. You're getting 10,000 yen experience. Not so bad, right? <laughs> uh, do you want to hear a more detailed explanation on the machine? That won't be necessary. Now have a try yourself. <laughs> guardian of Rage, Flaming Jester. Let's try Guardian of Rage, I guess. Son of a bitch is lighting me on fire! Can't do more than fifty. Okay. <laughs> All right, now it's back to normal. Uh, 
if you beat your enemies while playing, your own ability should increase as well. But it appears that abilities will only increase the first time you beat an enemy. So try and fight a range of different enemies to reap the most benefit. Give it a try. the flaming jester. <laughs> I'm going into the matrix. Oh my god. Oh, this guy. <laughs> He's a pain in the ass. Of course. I could beat him. I can beat him. I want my XP. If I was going to kill you, I'd demolish him. Final Fantasy nerds to this and I trade the one villain for the other. 
some chicken earlier. I was eating some chickies. Alright. Let me go. I'll switch characters. Screw this. Yeah, some chicken. Some good grade A chicken. You don't even like chicken. How can you not like chicken? Uh, chicken's good. It's good, it's good for you. Have some air fried chicken. That good stuff with some broccoli. You want fish, you can't handle fish. I found uh, 1,000 yen on the underground, on the ground in the underground mall, a whole thousand. Wow, I'm near fortune. I know, right? But then suddenly, while I wasn't looking, this little shit came up and it was, you know, he lost the cash and shit, you know, underground mall, pickpocket, blah, 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 okay. Oh. Underground mall, you say. You want fish. Why do you want fish? Gefilte fish. It's gefilte fish. Uh, you're the one who helped that woman escape. What news? Where'd she go? You'll tell us all right. Even if we have to beat it out of you. I always wanted another fight. That dude got a golf club. And the other one got a bat.
Wow, you broke the thing I was gonna use, you piece of shit. Start over at Scout, yeah? Huh. Oh. Uh, Scout's, uh, like a doorman, I guess. Oh, a doorman. Yeah, I should have said so in the first place. So, what's going on? You know those men in black you just fought off? Uh, there are some lurking around our club, too. And? I was just wondering if you happen to know who they are. Nope. Sorry. Oh, alright. I suppose I'll have to alert the police then. Uh, with those creeps hanging around, our guests don't feel safe. We're losing business and fast. It's fine though. Uh, if you don't know, you don't know. Thanks anyway, and sorry to have bothered you. Back down the manhole I go. Where I stop, nobody knows. They called me a madman. I wasn't. All because I was selling trash. I told them, no, I'm not crazy. You're all crazy. It's all lies, I tell you, lies. Actually, I I have the potions. Oh, by you are the trace. What do you mean I'm the trace? I can't be the trace. Having some five star leftovers. Mmm. Yummy. I got XP from Bro Team, bro. Trace! <laughs> trace! <laughs> in harm's way too so make sure you're all ready to do i am ready sensei huh. hey grandpa find that buried treasure yet buried treasure <laughs> again leave me alone you bunch of hooligan riffraff uh look he's still with that guy from the other day talk about lucky i brought some friends with me this time how about we have a little party an eye for an eye. This just common sense, ain't I right? <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't think of a better time to arrive. You little dung your own graves. Uh, we're so close, too. You just keep on digging. What? These punks got no right to cross your dreams. You just keep on digging. But... I can take out the trash on my own. 
I got your back, so just keep swinging that pickaxe. Alright, I'll leave it to you. No problem. The hell you two bickering about? This is a fucking sitcom or something? Finish saying your prayers, cause we're gonna kill you all kinda dead. I'm gonna beat the shit out of everybody. Get, get traced, get traced. Bitch. I got a great idea. Here you go. What the? Where did this dude come from? I guess it's an infinite respawn. That means infinite XP. Hold up. Infinite enemies means infinite XP. Yeah, I'm gaining little bits of XP. I demand more XP. More! flabbed rumor about there being money down here anyway. Well, I mean, it does kind of have that buried treasure look, don't you think? Huh? Look, another book. Another fighting manual. Looks like, hey, just like the others, this one's filled with different practical techniques. Finding this many books gets me thinking we might just stumble across an actual person that buried all of them. Uh, your old man a collector of these kinds of books? Yeah. No, my father was a born and bred soldier, a fearless man who proudly fought for his country. I see. Then I guess uh, these books wouldn't uh, belong to him. In either case, I can't afford to pass these up. Uh, hope you don't mind if I take them. Learn the great bomber. Hmm. Let's start digging the next path. Uh, come back whenever you can. I'll see you to the entrance. I am ready, Sensei. Old access tunnel. We might find. 
find a chunk of wood ash lying around somewhere, but then you'll have to connect the two. I remember hearing about some kind of weapon shop in Kamurocho that will make things for you as long as you got the materials. A shop that will make get me a pickaxe using super alloy and a chunk of wood ash? I'll keep an eye out. Sorry for the trouble. Be seeing you once you got the strong enough pickaxe. Huh. I know where to go for the shop, but the thing is, where to get the materials. I'm curious. I gotta go to Theater Square to get to him, I think. No! Another rando. Oh, the Yakuza. Take out the trash. The trash. 
Jesus. I don't think. Perhaps. Hey, yo, he said perhaps. <laughs> the moon's with that face. <laughs> thing that I need. Oh well. Well, there goes that. Oh, crap. Oh, wait a minute. Huh? Spike shoulder pad. up anyway during uh, regular fights. At least I got the increased damage and then also the new technique. So that works. Uh, let me go switch characters then. Not yet my ass beat for a moment. How did I hit the guy behind me?
miss playing Fist of Morton Star. <laughs> between main characters, your money points accumulated from the casino and coliseum as well as items stored in the item box will all be consolidated. Also places that only certain main characters could enter may now be accessible by others. Try exploring Gamarocha with each of the four main characters. all the old stuff that I had on him. Alright. Well, that works out anyway. to go to the, the old man, the professor, with uh, Akiyama. What the hell is this guy wearing? Rich looking man, you look like you know a thing or two about fighting. Was at level 15 with him, no wonder.
しゃいませ Draws you in with the beauty seems ancient and mysterious. It's worth a hundred thousand. Where did my golden plate go? Hmm. <laughs> Did I not get a golden plate? Never took a little boy as a hostage and is using him as a shield on that roof over there. I saw the woman chasing them, though. Hope everything's all right. Even a detective might have trouble if she's all alone. This is a rare type of case. Perhaps this will give me a revelation. Must obtain more revelations to increase my power. I don't see anybody. Oh, there it is. Kidnapping sure are scary. I wonder what color they were. <laughs> I don't think I got it. I think it was the second one. I oh, know. Looks like I did. <laughs> That's badass. Well, at least no wood block this time. Yep. <laughs> hey, Mac. I just saw an intense scene. A lady detective chased down a man who kidnapped a boy. The kidnapper tried to get a cheap peek under the detective's skirt, but the boy took advantage of the situation and rammed him with it. That's where it counts. That's 
Two hundred thousand. Yeah, no way. <laughs> Next thing you know, he's gonna say half a million and then a million. Some really good data. 
heat gauge growth rate increased. Oh, so that's why. Battle experience data received from IF7. Come back again. Yeah, so that's what that does. Okay. That's actually very worth for all the characters, then. laughing he think this is a game <laughs> he thinks life is just a game for him oh yeah did you hear about the the warhammer thing that uh, happened oh yeah that is, that shit's wild. It is. Everyone's going nuts about it. Oh, what the hell? Hey, yo! Nightmares right there. Damn. I got him in the infinite loop. Send them flying. That's literally R1 Triangle. That is his version of Tiger Drop. R1 Triangle, Tiger Drop. Now they're on Heaven on Earth, Rye Alone, and the Sugar Coating One. Imaginary Technique, R1 Triangle, Tiger Drop. I'm on fire!
Got him with the low. Two thousand XP, nice. Uh, he gets another crazy on a slower rant. Come on, dude. Bro. Plus three hundred. I don't know. <laughs> Time to do the final one with Akiyama. Well, I'm not that worried about Akiyama's level, but I'm still worried about Saijima. He's only level 13. I want to get him at least to level 15 to unlock his other stuff. The best thing for me to do, I guess, is to do the underground tournament to gain some decent XP for him. I don't really got a choice. And then do this to increase his heat gauge further. Here we go with this. The spamming kick does not fail. Spamming the kick button! <laughs> Damn it, take damage. Nice. Got him right there at the end. Heat gauge capacity increase. Wow, this heat gauge is off the rails. Oh, I love Yakuza 4 Akiyama combat. Oh yeah, this is awesome. Him and Kiryu are by far probably the best out of the four. But Kiryu just being overwhelmingly god tier. <laughs> or one triangle tiger drop. <laughs> in the way.
Time to give them the hands. The hands of justice. Aqua Devils. Oh, these guys again? <laughs> I like how Kyrie, when he gets hit, he, like, he barely falls over. He's like, where are these guys hitting me? <laughs> I don't remember. <laughs> what, that one? Sure has been a while. Oh, are you still working on that invention of yours? <laughs> uh, don't assume it's the same as that hunk of junk a year back. I call this the Inner Fighter 7 Revolution, or the IF7R for short. The IF7R, huh? Uh, it's got a slew of new features, and the structure is way more stable <laughs> compared to before. Some of the mechan uh, mechanisms have changed, so be careful about that. Do you want to hear more in detail? That won't be necessary. Devil, wait a minute, hold on. One eye devil's Majima. We all know who that is. There's no hiding that. <laughs> I can fight you with Majima in the simulations. <laughs> it's just like the simulations. <laughs> the man <laughs> I barely took a dent in damage <laughs> 2000 plus an extra 300 and that okay yeah it does nice so this is definitely worth <laughs> We're fighting the one-eyed devil, what else? <laughs> nope. It's time to go absolutely disgustingly ham. R1 triangle, R1 triangle. <laughs> Out of thin air. 
He's too strong for the simulations, that's why. This just proves it. Brawl. <laughs> I just barely made that. That fight didn't even last a minute. We almost killed each other in a simulation. That's how terrifying a man he is. 2000 XP, heat gauge, capacity increase, battle experience data. I'm close to leveling. <laughs> It's worth doing these simulations, these simulations. to the chainsaw powers. unlocking the heat gauge for these characters. They gotta spend $10,000 just to re-unlock something that they lost years ago. <laughs>
Oh, tiger drop. That did damage. Good God. <laughs> One tiger drop did uh, so much damage. Oh my God. I am right there at leveling. Return of the king. <laughs> Facts. Just that one giant hit. <laughs> And I level. <laughs> that was one way to level up. Techniques. A finishing blow named for its immense power. Uh, an attack with immense power that belies its simplicity. the type of guy like you run up to him you hit him and then he hits you back you're done it's over i just ended that man's life what happened to him <laughs> you hit him with my fist what <laughs> Enough. 
not with devils. Let's see, how many are there? <laughs> they all got scared when I picked that up. やめて。話してる。そうでも話しなさい。うん、ま、え。あ?うん。上手だ。目を隠しているではないかい。うん。それ。そうそう。あ、それ。何やった?うん。でも分からないようだね。Get wrecked. <laughs> Double KO. I tie around the head. I should try that sometimes. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> That's the second time I did that and I got nothing. Son of a... So it's the first one after all. I'm here to buy some drugs. Huh, <laughs> it's because you were Uber. Bruh, the Uberism. <laughs> Darkwing Duck, let's get dangerous. Darkwing Duck. <laughs>
pop him over the head. Ah, here we go. You finally made it. I hear you gave some of my boys a real talking to. Maybe I can return the fa- Well, you're- You're him! What's wrong? I thought you had some kind of business with me. Um, well, uh, it's just- Uh, what's wrong, Anaki? Let's take him out! I know, I don't need you to tell me that. Listen, kid- I mean, old man. Huh, we Kamarocho Aqua Devils don't back down from a fight till we win. You must want to die just strolling up here so tough and all. He knows who Kirio is. That's the best way. Alright, come at me anytime then. I got orders to. I'm going to teach you punks a lesson. And after I beat you, uh, you better stay away from Kamarocho. Uh, guard, got it? Good luck with that. Uh, you don't know who you're starting shit with. Your ass is mine! Remember your promise, leave the Kamarocho guard alone. What? You think I don't know you, man? You're Kazuma Kiryu. To think Kazuma Kiryu is back in Kamarocho. Kiryu? You mean the dragon of Dojima? That Kiryu? Holy shit, Kiryu's here! Kazuma Kiryu's back in town! <laughs> Kiryu-san, buddy, don't you, <laughs> don't you think just because you beat me, you can't let your guard down? What do you mean? I could care less about Kamarocho Guard. From now on, the gangs are going to be fighting over who gets to take a shot at you. The guy that ran off is sure to let everyone know that Kamarocho's strongest, Kazuma Kiryu, is back in town. 
the gangs will have a field day, but it ain't gonna stop at Camarocho. They'll come from all over hoping to get street cred by taking your ass down. I heard that most feared gang boss in Olacanto is setting his sights on Camarocho. I'd like to see who'd win in that fight. Well, subplot opened. <laughs> Time to fight multiple gang members until I take them all down. <laughs> you certainly managed to clean up the uh, Aqua Devils quickly. Very impressive, Kyuya-san. With their leader removed, the gang should be much less of a threat now. Here's a little something to say thank you. Oh, triple S powder gun. Uh, gunpowder. That's some rare stuff right there. That stuff is like cocaine. <laughs> There's always the chance that you may run into some of their remaining members. If you do come across any of them, please bring us some proof that you've driven them out of town. I'll be more than happy to offer you a reward. I'm normally standing in front of the theater, so you can come by anytime. Alright, eh, I'll come to you. If I take down their remaining members, I'll be waiting. Things are getting out of hand. Word is the gang are all out to get me now. I hope I'm not putting you in danger. Oh, the contrary. It was only a matter of time before gangs began to gather and fight in Kamarocho. Please don't blame yourself. Although we lack the strength to deal with them ourselves, we'll do whatever we can to help. Alright? Bro, why is it every time this man comes back into town, all of a sudden shit starts up? And this is just a side quest. <laughs> this man comes back into town, the whole world wants this man dead. <laughs> no one knows that he lives in Okinawa. <laughs> My technique, that was Komaki's. I just ended that man's life. has emerged. I'm writing to tell you a little bit about them. As it happens, they're more of a biker gang. They wear their own gangland coats. Huh, their gang name appears to be Commodore Phonies. That's a name. Okay. I say appears to be because that's how I think their name on their coats is read. Uh, it actually is quite difficult to read the characters, so forgive me if I've gotten it wrong. Fewer and fewer kids are joining biker gangs these days, but this gang is an exceptional, exceptionally large one. If they see you, they're apt to try to uh, stare you down and pick a fight with you. Please take care. Time to fight a biker gang! Might as well max out levels on Kiryu and make him go full god mode. Excuse me, sir. 
sir, I needed to spray and pray with a shotgun. Why don't you people give me money, you pieces of sh- mm. Shiitake mushrooms. Now where's this biker gang? This album. I've heard this song. Oh my god, they have this song in this game? I love this song. I forgot the name of this song. How have I never noticed that? Trace. Yes, not, not for me. the biker games where are they I don't see them I want to fight the biker games sir where are the biker games Uh, it smells, he smells of blood. I want the biker guys! <laughs> now where are they? Why do people give me drugs and not money? I demand money, not drugs. <laughs> Biggest development will be when Kiryu fully uh, buttons his shirt? Yeah. <laughs> the ultimate character development. This man never does, he just keeps it open. Like, I don't believe in such things. Where are the biker gangs? Practically pulling up Batman trying to find them. Where are they? Where? The Aqua Devils. 
a survivor. Where are the biker gangs, boy? Where are they? Where are the biker gangs? A people's elbow on the dude. <laughs> Shit, lost again. You win this one, but we'll be back. I got a gang emblem. Hey, yo, I straight stole their gang emblem. <laughs> uh, emblems that represent the number of gangs you defeated. Right now, you've defeated one. He, I don't think he gonna answer with his face caved in. <laughs> Where are the gangs? Where are they? <laughs> I need sustenance. I need bloodshed. I require it. Just, just calm down, okay? It's normal to feel crabby. Uh, where are the other gangs going? <laughs> Why are they leaving? I thought they wanted my blood. <laughs> The very formula, in other words, and there's a whole lot of law, something wrong. Uh, oh, it's really nothing. Okay, it's actually something, but I'll take care of it somehow, if you're sure. No, wait, sorry, but I really need some help here. What kind of help? You see, uh, uh, what was that little pose? What? That was gay. <laughs> Never do that again. <laughs> Things that I crashed my bike, you know, blah blah blah, wreck something, yada yada, okay, yada yada, blah blah. Man, how do I keep getting dragged into these things? Are you really sure the lunches are ruined? Hmm, I guess the rice is still pretty much edible, but the side dishes are complete loss. And nobody wants a lunch of just rice, right? Sure, it's simple and zen and all that, but you gotta have a side dish, obviously. Then why don't you go pick some side dishes around here? It's gonna be expensive, but it's your responsibility after all. Oh, man, that is, like, the perfect idea. Why didn't I think of that? You're a genius, man. Good one, buddy. All right. Uh, well, good luck, kid. Thanks, man. Uh, sorry. It looks like I hurt my legs in the crash. Ouch. Oh, my leg must be broken. It hurts like hell when I put my weight on it. Hmm. If it was broken, you couldn't stand up. A anyways, I really feel bad <laughs> asking <laughs> it all. But would you go get the food for me? <laughs> uh, this game's too funny. Fine. Uh, lazy ass. Guess I gotta see this through. Fine, kid. I'll help you out. Really? Uh, dude, you mean it? This kid is starting to get on my nerves. Oh, uh, what kind of lunch was it supposed to be? It was curry lunch. Like I said, the rice is still okay, but the sauce is a mess. Curry, huh? So I guess that's what I should go look for, then. Sorry, buddy. We really hate to put you out like this. Yeah, sorry about this, but... Could you make it quick? Yeah, yeah, just wait here. Hmm, curry. I'm pretty sure there's a restaurant or something around here that has it. I don't know where a fucking curry restaurant is. Actually, no wait. I lied. I think I do know. Uh, smile burger. Wish it would give me a description, but it won't. Where's the bike again, boy? <laughs> I need bloodshed. Show me.
will be back. Another gang emblem. I'm collecting emblems. Are you a biker gang member? Mm. <laughs> I need the violence. Fight the biker gang. It's all I want to do. It's all I ever wanted to do. I just, you know, I just want to tear them apart. That's not curry. That's ramen. Where is curry spot? Does that look like curry? I don't know. No, it doesn't. Where's it curry? the biker gang where's the curry spot where do I buy the sauce the sauce Biker, why the hell are you trying to fight me? Why? You want to just take these L's? Right on his throat, no less, bro. Next toy is signed. Wait, toy is 99 signed. Absolute degeneracy. The maidenless activity. Maidenless. No, well, that's not the rest of Where is the restroom? That I seek. Where is it? I don't see it at all. It's not here. This is it. You do not have what I need. I demand sustenance. Ah, pretty nice. Ah, the protein. I had to get my protein. This again? Hmm? Didn't know this could happen for you to you. It's the same as Akiyama, and this just makes it easier. Like, wording wise.
got pooped. Nice work, kid. There's no escape when you're up on the roof. And what must have been the first one? There a vehicle on top of the roof here. What? One the butt. I am so confused. everything. Where are all these keys coming from all of a sudden now? Nope, they didn't spawn back. Okay. Buy lighter fluid of corner store and shit. Alright, here we go. 
I got curry. Got the sauce, we're not gonna want to eat it cold. There ought to be a stove I can use at New Serena. I'll run over and eat it up. Serena, 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 Serena. I need to heat up this protein. Dante, you mind if I borrow your stove? Help yourself. I never had you pegged for a cooking type. I don't have much choice. I have to heat up this curry. Well, have at it. Thanks. It'll only take a sec. Heat it up the large curry take on bags. Man, heating up that much curry took longer than I expected. Thanks, Dante. Sure, no problem. I better hurry back to the construction site. Oh, I thought there would be a timer. There's the biker gang. You pop up when I don't need you to pop up, you son of a bitch. Uh, the pizza from Zero? Yeah, pretty much. I, I thought it would be like that. like that now and the com Commodore phonies I presume. What the fuck you just say? Uh, the feet it's Phoenix, you fucking senile fool, get worried. Uh, it's written on our uniforms for crying out loud. What are you illiterate? The uh, this really brings me back. Huh? What are you talking about? Uh, that joke of a uniform reminds me of how I used to go around crushing one gang after another when I was young. Yeah, so what? It's ironic, I have to do it all over again. Kind of a downer, actually. Oh well, I guess a trip down memory lane is a good once in a while. So, basically, you're trying to say you're gonna crush us too. That it? Stop beating around the fucking bush. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm saying. But enough small talk. I wish you good luck. <clears throat> I'll warn you though, I'm stronger now than I was back then. This won't end pr uh, pretty if you half-ass it. Now show me what you're made of. You don't gotta tell me. Come on, guys. Once we waste this geezer, we'll be strongest in Kamarocho. gangs these days as weak as you? Uh, pathetic. Uh, GD. 
Gosh darn it. Hey, this is starting to get annoying, so I'll cut to the chase. You guys have a boss, right? Hurry up and go fetch him now. If I take him down one-on-one, -on -one, then that should put an end to this. Shut your fucking mouth. The boss can wipe the floor with your ass in a blink of an eye. He's not going to waste his time on the likes of you. So, you want another go? We could do this a thousand times, but it'll always come out the same way. But if that's what you want, fuck it. Uh, boys, we're calling in the cavalry. Ask the boss to get everybody together. We're going to waste you before word gets out about this to the other gangs. <laughs> They're going to hit me with more? It wouldn't matter if you sent a million of you after me. Hey, just about enough out of you, smartass. Next time we meet, I'm gonna make sure that chatty mouth of yours never opens again. Nice and hot. Yes, Curry finally is here. Curry, Curry, we love Curry, huh? Hey, boss. Isn't it a little too early to celebrate? Huh? What's supposed to mean? Sure, we finally got our curry, but the real question is, does it taste any good? It's not over. Ugh, hungry. Crap. The curry we ordered was supposed to be from a famous curry shop, but how does this curry stack up? Maybe we should taste it before we get too excited. True enough. I don't know, <clears throat> know what I'd do without that sharp mind of yours. The assistant foreman's right. It all comes down to the taste. Don't think you're out of the woods yet, boy. Okay. How was it? They don't know. It's fantastic. Tastes great. Yeah, it's delicious. Yes, dude. I like it. Man, you are like my idol. I don't think I could have done this without you. I thought your leg was broken. It's a miracle. It feels better now that I'm so pumped up. <laughs> if you say so. Dude, thank you so much. I should have totally asked before, but what's your name? I'm Tomia. Kazuma Kiryu. Kiryu? Got it. Man, even your name is badass. I really wish there were some way I could thank you, but this is all I got. I know it's kind of a lame reward, but it comes from the heart. Good enough. Be careful not to crash your bike again. I will. Take care, kitty son. Alright, we had our break. Now back to work. Okay, boss. Boss. 5,000 XP. Another one of them gang members. Yes, it's time for bloodshed. You are so small. <laughs> I want to destroy you, gang member. I want to destroy all the gangs in Kamarocha. You don't understand. I need to. I want to. Unlimited power! Oh. <laughs> Preschoolers could fight better than you. Damn! Just bring me your boss, I'm a busy man. Where is your boss? Where is he? I want him dead! There's like a whole bunch of side quests all over the place that I can do, and I don't do. 
Oh, there's a T up there. Nice. Kiryu-san. Hey, is that really you? That's right. And you are? It's me, uh, Shiraki. Five or so uh, years ago, we really had it out in the Champion District, remember? Hold on. Shiraki, from White Edge? Uh, you got it. Huh, long time no see. Sure, it has been a while. Damn, you really look <clears throat> look like a changed man. You're not running with the color gangs anymore. Oh yeah, I left the gang uh, game a long time ago. Well, actually, White Edge dissolved right after our little run-in. That's so. Yeah, uh, you know, everybody makes mistakes when they're young, I guess. But I'm too old to be stirring up trouble like that now. So, what are you up to these days? Uh, you're not gonna believe this. I started my own company, called Platinum. We sell used cars. A car dealership. Sounds like a decent enough line of work. <laughs> yeah. I can do all the... <clears throat> I can do all right for myself when I put my mind to it. And thanks to my change in careers, I make more money now than almost any other guy I know my, my age. There are some things we deal in that I can't exactly announce to the world, though. So I guess my company is kind of like what you call a front, too. Still, it sounds like you're doing all right, all in all. Yeah, it wouldn't have happened without you. Oh, that's right. Let me give you a bit of my business card. Just give me a call if you ever need a good car. I mean it. You name it, and I'll find it for you. Anyway, see you around. All of a sudden, Kiryu needs a car. by paying customers? Uh, that's the way I talk to anybody who acts like a dick, you dick. That's Kotono. Oh, don't tell me he's getting into trouble working it. Mm. Hey, Kotono, what's all this about? Get you, son. I'm uh, just a little busy right now. Can I wait? What do you mean, busy? Uh, aren't these guys your customers? Yeah, our customers responsible for this kid and where do you learn his manners? Leave Kiryu out of this jackass. Jackass? Who the hell you think you are, you little brat? Yeah, we'll see who's the jackass. <clears throat> jackass is, you ready to get your teeth knocked in? Come on, enough already. No need to keep this up out here. Oh, you're creating a public disturbance. Put a sock in it, Pops. Uh, if your friend of this kid then we ought to teach you some respect, too. <clears throat> Don't know what kind of disco reject you're supposed to be, but you're both in for a beating. He called him a disco reject. <laughs> nah, you get the hands for that. You're gonna hate my 80s style, you dumb bitch. Get massacred. Son of a... Who the hell are you two? I'm the ultimate uh, busboy in your face. Just you wait. We'll get you. Whew. Doing a good deed always gives you a warm feeling down deep in your heart, don't it? Well, better get back to work. <laughs> That's his boss. Sorry, but you're fired. What? But why? Why? Not only did you talk back to the customers, you got into a street fight with them. Sorry, there's no way I can let you work here. Please don't come back. I got fired again. What am I doing wrong? Judging from what I just saw, a lot. <clears throat> Look, why don't you try and explain to me what happened? Okay. 
me see. What do you mean you're packed? Oh, we're starving. That means there's no room for you. We ain't got no seats left. <clears throat> what do you want me to say? You sure got a funny way to talking to customers. And what the hell is that back there then? Those seats are open. They're reserved. Reserved? Like we give a shit. You got open seats. We're taking them. The hell you are. If you want to eat, wait like everyone else. Uh, don't want to wait, then take a hike. What the hell did you say, boy? Uh, that the way you talk, <clears throat> talk to paying customers? <clears throat> Alright, I think I get it now. What did I say that was wrong? It's not what you said, it's your attitude. The way you said it. If you're an employee, then you got to know how to act like one. Act like an employee? What's that mean? Well, when you go out to uh, go eat out at a restaurant, all the staff are polite, right? Yeah, that's true. They bow, smile, and all that crap. What the hell is that supposed to be about anyway? Uh, being a customer uh, doesn't make you a god or something. That's not why employees are polite. It's because they want the customer to enjoy the time they spend at their restaurant. Sure. Some customers act like jerks, but you still got to show them the same polite service. That's all part of the job. You can't be uh, arguing with the customers, and sure as hell you can't get in fights with them. Okay, I don't really get it, but fine. It ain't exactly my strong suit, but I'll try being polite from now on. Oh, and I won't punch my customers anymore either. That much I promise. Good. Uh, don't you forget it. You got it. Uh, but that's it. I they better start looking for another job. Thanks, Kitty or something. Uh, I'll let you know when I land something good. Yeah, he's gonna get another street fight. Where the hell is this biker gang? I demand bloodshed. All I've been doing is brutalizing people, doing random side quests, quest with Kiryu and all that. Uh, check it out, I found a brand new job, now I'll be working at Sushi Jin restaurant. I promise you Kiryu-san, I definitely won't be smacking any customers around. Stop by sometime, I'll be waiting for you. Hey, buddy. Ten years in the slammer made you a pussy. Ten years out of the cell made you a bitch. <laughs> want to be damn straight, I'm coming around, man, born and raised right here in Kamarocho, eh? I'm not some fucking bitch. You old fart are fucking everywhere in Kamarocho and making you real dead. What I do, I like your spirit. All right, then. Let's see what you got. You talk big now, but I'll have you know I'm number two in this organization. You about to be bagged and tagged. Let's get him. Number two. I'm number two. You're about to be number zero. And end it. That man's life. Where he got the boss on this? You're a dead man walking. I didn't see what he said. Crap. Where the hell is this boss at? Probably in the same spot as the other guy. Wouldn't be surprising, actually. Let's see what's 
going on in here. Evening, mind if I take this scene? Apologies, sir. But that one specifically was reserved for the rest of the night. A reserved scene? At the counter? That's strange. I won't disagree with that, sir. Guess I'll just sit here instead. Ah, uh, this one's not reserved, is it? Most well, certainly not. There you go right ahead, sir. A martini? What's the glass for? Nobody's even sitting there. I see you notice, sir. To tell the truth, that seat is... Ah! Shiguza-san. Oh, it's a whole ass cutscene. Damn! Why is she angry? Damn! <laughs> Slap me! What I go? What I do? <laughs> what the fuck? You could have at least called me when you got back to town, but no. All you ever think about is yourself. There's only so much bullshit one girl can take. I give and give and give, and all I get back is lies. Well, no more. I think you got the wrong guy. I don't even know who you are. Uh, gee, you son, Yachio. Uh, are you seriously pretending you don't remember me? How low are you gonna stoop? How could I remember you when we've never met? You're kidding, right? Uh, you promised me you would come back to Kamarocho and we could be together again. I waited for you all this time and look what I got. I did? What? Don't tell me that was another one of your lies. Where have you been this past year anyway? Look, I honestly don't know who you are, but maybe I can help you find the guy you're looking for. What's his name? I'm Kiryu, by the way. So, I, so you're going by a different name now. Do you really want to avoid me that badly? Well, I've had enough of the lies. I've heard them all before. First, it's business out of the country. Then you need money for an accident. It's just never ends. I'm telling you, you got the wrong guy. Fine. But if you're really gonna keep playing dumb, I'll just have to refresh your memory. Well, let's go. She wants me to come with her? I really have no idea what she's talking about, though. Come on, the clock's ticking. I can make you remember me. Just you watch. Might as well. Alright. Ah, uh, cutie, you should have countered. Yeah! <laughs> R1 triangle! <laughs> R1 triangle! <laughs> Alright, I guess I can spare some time. Oh, why didn't you say so in the first place? Uh, whatever, let's start over at the Mach Bowl. You must remember Mach Bowl, right? I, I know it, yeah, but wait a minute. Oh my god, isn't this the chick that worked at the Mach Bowl? Oh, no! <laughs> That's like way back in, um... In, I think it was the first Yakuza game. Um, let's go. That that was with uh, one of the Majima uh, fights. <laughs> We're here. What are you waiting for? Let's go inside. Right. She was behind the counter, wasn't she? Well, remember now? We used to come here together all the time. Ah. Uh, seriously don't remember. Uh, you were working behind the counter? Wait! Okay, never mind. Yes, wrong person indeed. You were working behind the counter, and not long after I got my job here, you asked me out. It was so romantic. I hate to sound like a broken record, but that wasn't me. Uh, you're really starting to make me mad, you know that? Oh, uh, Chiguza-san. Long time no see been feeling better? I'm a okay now, thanks. Uh, did you ever end up uh, figuring things out with your wife? Oh, that. Uh, we're long over it. Uh, yeah, just one of those typical husband-wife arguments. You know how it goes. By the way, I found some of uh, Yusaku, uh, Yusaku Kun's things in the back room the other day. Mind if I leave them with you? 
second. Thanks. Yeah. I thought he had taken it all with him yeah, when he left, but I guess not. I suppose he did leave in a hurry. Oh, sorry. I guess it's still kind of... Don't worry about it. Well, I should be on my way. There's somewhere else we need to go. Oh, hold on a moment, sir. Could I ask... How do you know just now? Honestly, I don't know. I think she has me mistaken for her old boyfriend or something. Oh. Now that I think about it, you do have a pretty stark resemblance to Yusaka Boon. Yusaka Boon, your boyfriend, huh? He was, yes. Come on, we don't have time to stay around here all day. There's somewhere else I want to take you. Listen, um, if it's not too much trouble to ask, it would be really great if you could give uh, Jews on some company today. I have a feeling she needs now more than ever. I don't even know if I'm saying your name right. Jesus. Uh, what were you doing in there? Come on, let's go. Where to? Well, I picked up all your stuff, so... Uh, we should probably drop by our office. Our? Huh? Off? Yup. I'm sure seeing it in person will jog your memory. Come on, let's go. Why am I getting dragged into things that I don't want to do? I want violence. I just wanted a drink and then go back to violence. <laughs> what is this place? Don't you remember? It's the import store we started together. Store? There's no store in sight. Don't be ridiculous. Here, let's go inside. I left everything just the way it was. Well, this is our office, remember? It's just an online store, so we don't have a sign or storefront or anything. Sure, but where's the actual stuff you were importing? Oh, what do you mean? Before it came in, you... So, you finally here. You're putting us in a real pinch here, you know that? You gotta clear out this office now. Oh, it's you. Uh, don't give me that. Your lease ran out six months ago. Now pack up and get out before the real trouble comes knocking. You can call this an import shop or whatever, but your president's out of the picture, lady. Just let it go. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Look, if you don't get packing, we're gonna do more than just rough you up a little. Hey, that's enough. She doesn't deserve this. What's it to you? And besides, she most definitely does deserve it. The broad squatting in a building that's not hers. I hear you. How about this? You give us some time to talk. <clears throat> she feels me in on what's going on here, and I help her move out once she's done. It won't be long. Yeah? Like we're gonna trust some clown we've never even laid eyes on before. We're not fucking around here, asshole. Guess there's no point in talking, then. <laughs> if you're not gonna go... <clears throat> go of your own free will, we'd be glad to lend you a hand. Come on, boys, let's chuck these fools out. tough cookie. How about you guys call it a day? I'll make sure she gets the contract handled. Or do you need another round of convincing? Alright, alright. Guess we'll be on our way then. Put the stuff from the bowling alley over there in the corner there. Oh, thanks. Sorry I messed up your office. By the way, uh, no, it's alright. Uh, thank you for helping me. Looks like you have a message on your machine. 
trailing, but I haven't been using this place for almost a year now. Who would try to call me here? Let's listen. Ah, uh, Chiguza-san. I hope this message reaches you. Yeah, it's Yusaku. Uh, there's something I need to tell you. Something I didn't have the guts to say in person. The truth is, I don't have much time left. The doctor said a month, maybe two. Cancer just spread so quickly. I... There was nothing I could do. You probably think this is just another one of my lies. I honestly didn't believe it at first either. I mean, dying before I even hit 30. It sounds like a bad joke, but... It's the truth, no matter how hard I want it not to be. I can only imagine how you're taking this. Something tells me you're gonna just laugh it all off. But I'm telling the truth, Chikusa. If I were there with you now, I'm sure I'd pretend like nothing was wrong. That's why I needed to do this over the phone. It was the only way I could tell you the truth. I know that seems like the cowardly way out, but I had to, had to happen this way. If you get this message, take a look in the desk for a pickup slip for the store called La March. Uh, the package that's waiting for you there will tell you how I really feel about you. Sorry for making you run errands even from the grave. <laughs> and I'm sorry I treated you the way I did. I'm sorry I'm leaving you behind like this. I'm sorry I ever loved you. I guess this is goodbye. I love you, Jesus. I always love you. And that's the truth. Dead. You can't really expect me to believe that. I mean, you're standing right in front of me. You always were a terrible liar. Yeah, you suck. I found an envelope just where he said it would be, and there's a slip for the march in here too. So, do you want to go? Yeah. Man! So the package here will tell me how you really feel about me. What's that supposed to mean? I couldn't say. I guess you'll find out once you hand that slip to the man behind the counter. Right. Let's go inside. Welcome to Lamar. Uh, hey, um, this place makes me kind of nervous. I don't really spend time in fancy shops like this. Oh, well, you have the pickup slip, right? Why don't you just hand it to the clerk? We can get it out of here. Do it for me. Sure. Let me see. The only thing I can think of is that it's gonna be a ring, so. Excuse me, I'm here to pick this up. Let me see. You know, this is from a year ago, yes? Hold on just a moment, sir. Here we are, sir. We set this order aside for a customer who said someone would come in by and pick it up later, but they never came. I suppose that would make you Yusako Iwasaki, yes? Hmm, this is the set of uh, matching platinum rings you requested. Rings? They appear to be engagement rings, ma'am. Yeah, that was the order we received, at least. Oh, right. Congratulations, I wish you two... Uh, wait. <clears throat> I wish the two of you all the best in your lives together. Now then, here are the rings. Why does Kiryu get put in these situations? Why? So, engagement rings, huh? Let's put them on. They're a pair, after all. As long as you're sure. It's too small for my fingers. Stop. Hey, what's wrong? I give up. Saka, he's gone. Sob. <laughs> Chiguza. I've known all this time, I just... Forget it. Just let me be alone. I don't think that's gonna help. We should go somewhere we can sit and take a breather. Fine. Right. Let's 
Let's go back to the Bontan. And then Musako and I used to go there together all the time. Got it, let's go. I wanted a drink from the start, and now I'm finally getting it after an hour. <laughs> you ready to head in? Yeah. Oh. Ah, uh, Jacuzzi song. Please, take a seat. it a year since he passed even still I had a feeling he would come in and drink today so he's really young he was so young too that's the scary thing about cancer sometimes it spreads so fast that it'll be far too late for treatment by the time you even know it's there there's a son who knows what happened but she can't seem to bring herself to believe you uh, yusaka kun is gone he had a bad habit of lying to her, so she convinced herself that his death was just another one of his lies. She convinced herself uh, I was Yusaka kun too. So it seems. And she goes to some. Eh, that's enough. I know it hurts to hear this, but waiting for Yusaka kun isn't going to bring him back. No. No, I don't believe it. Please, this is all just a stupid lie, right? He can't be dead. He just can't. This engagement ring was a lie, too. Uh, he never wanted to get married. He just ran away. Running away. After all those lies, why would he tell the truth this time? She goes him. Uh, I have a letter for you from uh, Yusaka. So... <clears throat> I think it's finally time for you to read it. A letter. He dropped it off when he found out he didn't have much time left. Told me to give it to you long after he was gone. Uh, that's when he told you he was leaving town. He didn't want to burden you with the death. With his death, he wanted you to move on, fall in love again. And he knew that you'd probably think this was just another one of his lies. He said that part with a, a little smile. I can remember it clear as day. Why didn't he tell me he only had a few months left? And we, hmm, and we get to spend that time together. I wish I could have been there to support him. Taco, I miss you so much. Chiguza. Are you crying? No, of course not. I would never cry over an idiot like that. I was just faking it, lying like he always did to me. Please, I'm fine. You don't have to worry about me anymore. Who's that? There's no point in hiding it. You can put on a brave face all you want, but I know you're hurting deep down. Now think about it. Misaku lied to you so you'd be happy. He knew he was dying, but told you one last lie to get you to move on and smile. So, if you're going to lie and say you're fine, the least you can do is smile while you say it for you, Saku. I'm not fine. Sob. <laughs> and that's okay. It's all right to cry. Chikosa. Uh, if you ask me, I don't think... Saku would have wanted you to hide how you really feel. Saku. Saku. Ah, ah. Finally, call me by the right name. Yeah, yeah. 
Yeah, I guess I did. I re really put you through a lot today, huh? What, that? It was nothing. Thank you. Well, you're an amazing person, too, you so. Might even fall for you if I'm not careful. Oh, wait. I still have those engagement rings from earlier. Will you marry me, cutie son? Hey, yo, what? <laughs> Hold up. <laughs> Just kidding. Another little lie. Sorry. You didn't believe me, did you? I almost did. <laughs> uh, he wanted it to be true. <laughs> Even so, I want you to have these. I don't need them anymore. something far more important than these rings today. And it's not just that if I hang on to them, I don't think I'll ever find the strength to move on. Alright. I'd be honored to take care of them for you. Well, I should be going. Goodbye, kitty son. Maybe something lying is the right thing to do. Finishing blow to me. Phoenix member. Still during battle to replenish your energy with the spirit of calm. Oh, Bahazin. Activate after a parry with increase your heat gauge by parrying enemies with spirit of a composed demon. Huh. Avoid receiving enemy attacks while in a parry stance. Oh, that's extremely useful.
Up to nothing. Another chase. Got the speed boost. Uh, and what are you selling? Uh, hemorrhoid cream, hair growth restorer, topaz. What? Look, I'm just selling stuff that uh, the top Yakuza out there are too embarrassed to buy on their own. Come on, just take this and leave me alone. Alright, got some cash. something uh, you don't seem like such a bad guy I need you to pay your tab at the Dragon Palace oh that's why you're here well too bad uh, why don't we just forget about that little matter and have ourselves some fun honestly I probably wouldn't mind but don't you think you should pay people what you owe it's only fair 
I suppose. You certainly are a brave boy. So I guess there's no more room for negotiating. I guess not. In that case, I have no choice, gentlemen. I want him out of my sight. Looking good, kid. You're almost there. One more to go, huh? So, uh, I can see Perry with him so much. Thank you. 
find the lighter. <laughs> that photo. I wish I noticed what it said. Oh well. <clears throat> I can fight the one-eyed devil, cold blooded fist. Start with the first few. The hardest one is gonna be Majima. The Majima one is gonna be hardest for all, all the other characters except Kiryu. <laughs> All this grinding just to beat the final chapter.
回っているぞ That's what's missing. I need to do his, uh, his real stuff. Real training, not the simulation training. Simulation training. or items.
get those hits in? with the interpreter, a witness, it showed me around, was big help. According to the staff working at the club that day, it, Gigi wouldn't say anything about himself until he started drinking. That club is frequented by more foreigners than Japanese, so it wasn't a language issue. Usually people talk up a storm when they're at a place they can talk in their native tongue. Exactly. People that can't speak Japanese are tempted to go to places like that to meet people that <clears throat> they can talk with. But that's not the case with Gigi. He went to the club by himself and drank without uh, talking to anyone else. Oh, what if it was a uh, rendezvous? Yes, uh, that's the only possibility. Gigi was there to meet someone else. Mm -hmm. I wonder if that was the reason he came to Japan, or is there something else? If that was the case, why would he get stupid drunk and yell like that? Maybe he drank too much while he was waiting, but a pretty dumb thing to do. And I have a case, and there is a strong possibility that GG at the club is the very same GG that we've been looking for. I'm close with that interpreter now, too, so I'll try and dig up more info if I can. Right, thanks, Marcos. By the way, where's Garcia? Uh, wasn't he supposed to be the embassy? Apparently, he ran into some trouble getting the embassy to contact the Japanese authorities. All I was told is that it's going to take a bit more time. Garcia, another friend of yours? Yeah. He knows a lot about international relations, so I'm having him take care of our communications through the embassy. Good thinking. If that GG is our killer, then that's probably the best way. Either way, we have to keep investigating while Garcia does his part. I'm going to do this some work. When Garcia gets back, tell him to stay here and wait for me. Got it. Uh, he feels the same way I do. Uh, he was a friend of my brother. Oh, really? My brother was a genuinely kind and intelligent guy, Marcos, and I both really loved him. Uh, that's why we can't believe what happened. Hmm. Marcos worked as a cop at the time, and he helped me out when I decided to become one, too, in order to find the killer. He's a friend, a truly irreplaceable friend. I see. Well, well waiting here may be my job, but this is just boring. Eh, come back whenever you have time, okay? For sure. Sure to check out anything relevant. Thanks. Keep me posted. We'll do. 
I should go investigate it, so it's possibly related to him, or any of that right here on the radio. I didn't get anything special for that. Whack. Well, that sucks. I'm only level 13 on him. Mm. I should save my cash. Gonna need it to get the. Well, he already has a lot of bars, though. I'll save my cash and use it on Saijima. So that way I can increase his amount of heat gauge bars. him money, they bribe him. Lay down your concealed weapons and surrender yourselves. Get out of the way or we'll kill you. Uh, hey, uh, you guys okay? Oh, Detective Tanamoria. Uh, glad you're here. Uh, they don't seem to understand a lot of Japanese. Oh, uh, we're having some trouble. Alright, I'll see what I can do. Can you shoo off the rubbernecks? Hey, you guys. Why do you give it a rest? Bah. Uh, we know you Japanese police can't even shoot your guns or it'd be against the law. What a bunch of cowards. Step aside. Hey, don't think I'm the same as you guys. You aren't uh, tough at all without your guns. The hell did you say? I'll end you right now. Lack of sleep for me today. 
That's not good. Don't you have work later today? Uh, listen, you don't need to have a dangerous stuff like that. Japan's pretty peaceful, you know? Uh, I don't care if you have them on you, but you can't, uh, but can you try to hide them better? And so it doesn't cause you more trouble. No, Thursday? Oh, nice. At least you got off. Uh, I have off till Thursday. Well, till Friday, technically. Well, Japan peaceful, you make me laugh. Uh, that's right. Uh, bullshit, it's peaceful. There's a mafia hitman hiding in Kamarocho. Mafia hitman? In our country, he's a famous professional assassin. He's some mafia protege hitman, and he's real dangerous. If Gigi ever gets you in his sight, he kills you. Even you won't stand a chance. Hold on. Did you just say Gigi? That's right. It's the name of the mafia boss. You know Gigi? Uh, the name of the guy, Nari. Uh, was after was named Gigi, too. Oh, man, GG. <laughs> That's the, that was the point of it, him being called that, uh, why he called himself that. Because it stands for good game, so that's why. If a Mafia protege assassin is here in Kamarocho, then it must mean that GG's here with his crew. Detective Tanamura, welcome back. Uh, we can take it from here. Oh, sure. Uh, I'll leave it to you guys, then. Information relating to GG, huh? Guess I'll go back to Nari and report it to her. Well... Might as well go back to reporter. That was fast. Yeah. I was gonna switch to Saijima. I wish there was a faster way to make money in this game, though. It's not like uh, Yakuza Zero where you're making money out of the wazoo, which was great. I miss those days. I miss having the business making five million like every minute and a half. No, not five million, five billion. That was great. Uh, if only Majima didn't introduce that tax. Yeah. Uh, that that was the funny part, the tax. <laughs> he he made that tax skyrocket at eight percent. He's like, I'm comfortable with five, but you know, if it goes up to eight percent, inflation. <laughs> Hold on, let me take a leak real fast. I'm back.
I have some info on of my own. It's about GG. Really? What is it? Some foreigners I arrested for possession of firearms said they were afraid of some assassin trained by GG and had to protect themselves. An assassin trained by GG? I might know the person they were talking about. Usually these types go out of their way to hide, but I hear GG is so strong he's using this guy like some kind of advertisement, so he's looking to scare the surrounding organization into submission. Clever. The same killer is apparently still walking the streets of Kamarocho. Kamarocho? I wonder if he was brought over here as a bodyguard in any case. This means GG is not alone. So, he's brought back up. Hmm. I don't know how many we'll have to face, but we need to stay on our toes from now on. Thanks for the info. I'll let Marcus know and the others know. Okay, I'll be keeping my eyes peeled too. Hi! Ooh. So, a pair to render them defenseless, then counterattack, I got it. Pimp smack a destiny. Pimp smack! Lost again. I know it's just boring, but I really hate losing. I know exactly how you feel, but thanks to you, I think I've gotten the hang of dealing with enemies after parry. Essence of arm dragging. I got some big business. Um, I said big business. Big news. <laughs> what is it? Uh, oh, Tadamoria son. Here's it. Too. Perfect timing. What's the news? Uh, someone cited the same GG that was seen at the club. We now know of a building he apparently enters every night. Good work. If that GG is our killer, then that building could very well be this hide his hideout. Where's the building? It's a, over across uh, Pink Street. Let's go check it out then. Wait, you need a warrant just to enter a building like that. And to get a warrant, you gotta have some degree of evidence. Sometimes I get fed up with the amount of paperwork here. I had no idea you were such a straight-edge cop, a ton of more. So, uh, that's not it. 
if I'm the one storming into the building, I couldn't care less about a piece of paper. But your position is a bit more complicated. If you guys enter illegally and get caught, your investigation is pretty much over. You got a point. I guess we best stick to Japanese rules to avoid a load of problems. We'll have to go about this carefully. First, go by that building and find out for sure if it's in fact the right GG. If you get the evidence, I'll take care of the paperwork, and then we can make our move. Got it. Uh, I'll look into it then. Sorry. Uh, did you hear from Garcia? Not a word. I just hope he's okay. I got a bad feeling about this. I'll see if I can find out anything. This is Japanese cell phone. Take it. It's prepaid, so you shouldn't run into any problem. Thank you. Uh, this should come in handy. Haven't seen prepaid phones in a long time. Good job finding one. Huh, you can still find them in some places. Pretty lucky that such services are still around. I'll give, give one for Garcia too. Make sure he gets one when he comes back. I ain't got it, thanks. Alright, I'll be back later. That guy really works hard. Uh, my brother always used to say Marcos uh, would become a... a <coughs> Would become a police officer one day because of his strong sense of justice. And now Marcus is one chasing the killer who murdered him. It's kind of ironic. You guys were all pretty close, weren't you? My brother didn't really get along with my parents, so he always kept finding me. Marcus was also one of his only friends. He wasn't really a people person. I see. So Marcus working on his case is his way of honoring your brother. All we can do now is chase down the killer and make him pay. Yeah, nobody can change the past. Exactly. There's no point in uh, moaning about it. Once we've put an end to the... Uh, I, ah, 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 uh, uh, end to this thing, <laughs> let's go out for some celebratory drinks. <laughs> Sounds good to me. Little, 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 little. English mofo. English. I know, bro. Fighters like us don't fare too well. The one grabbed. Okay, let's do it. A choice, do it, woman. Get bopped. <laughs> Release throw. Huh, I just don't get it. 
Why hasn't Garcia contacted me? How, ca how caught up could he be at the embassy? Lord Tenji, equality fighter. Well, of course! We're all about equality here! With our fists. <laughs> it got really dark real quick here. <laughs> I just hope everything's okay. Why do I have a feeling Garcia has betrayed us? Do you want me to try to check for you? Can you even do that? I, I think so. Well, let's see here. Mushy mushy. Hello? Uh, this is Tanamoria from Community Safety. Uh, I need you to look up a phone number. Huh? Already left? Yes. Uh, right. I see. Sorry for the trouble. Yakuza and betrayal should mean the same thing. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, what did they say? Garcia was at the embassy to file some papers, but left immediately after he was done. What? Uh, but... It's likely he got involved in something. Garcia. Uh, is there any way you can contact him? I haven't had the chance to give him the cell phone I got from Marcos yet. Uh, this may not be the best time to sit back and wait patiently. I'll go and look for more clues. Something might come up on the radio server. <laughs> Receiver. I'll let you know as soon as I hear something. Got it. Thanks. Socks to sock. Well, Sajiman's gonna have to deal with what he's gonna have. Weapon smuggling, ring spotted in that package. Oh, where did he go? Yo, uh, where's the wanted criminal you were talking about on the radio? Hey, Tanamoria. Uh, well, you see, we kind of lost him. Hmm, that's too bad. Well, I guess I'll look around for him. Uh, these cops don't give up. Hmm. Is that the wanted criminal that's on the run? Hey, you there. Can I talk to you? Damn, a cop. Uh, you'll never take me in. Uh, if you come along with me, we can avoid any unnecessary violence. I can't afford to get caught. Sorry, pal. But you're going to have to die. Uh, I thought I was going to have to chase him. This is better. Time. You ready to come along or now? Fine, I'll come with you. I'll come with you. If you 
protect me, huh? Oh, what you were saying. Use the cop and protect me. If they find out I've been caught, I'm a dead man. Who's they? Uh, a guy called GG. Once he sets his sight on you, you'll never escape until he's killed. Kills you. GG, the guy in the army is looking for. Uh, what did this GG guy tell you? Uh, I don't know anything. I was just asked to do a job. Huh. What were you asked to do? Uh, to get a massive amount of firearms and a chopper. A chopper? You mean like a helicopter? That's right. Uh, but I don't know what he plans to use it for. That's all I know. Alright, I got it. Just calm down. The police will take you into protective custody and... This man's about to... Yup, he got shot. He got shot. It's over. He dead. What? Uh... Hey. Hey. Uh... Hey, somebody call an ambulance. Tanamoya-san. Oh, we heard a gunshot. Yes. This man's been shot. The shooter has to be somewhere nearby. What? HQ. HQ. Uh, can you hear me? Looks like they were able to shut him up. Firearms and helicopters? I need a report on him. Just another day in the Yakuza of something dying. Yup. <laughs> Everyone dies. At least once. What is at this time a weapon buyer? I arrested a Kamanacho. Seems GG ordered a large amount of guns and a helicopter to boot. A helicopter? What are they going to use that for? No clue. Uh, but the buyer was gunned down in cold blood right in front of me. They wanted to make sure he didn't talk. That's terrible. This also means the weapons have already made it into the hands of the enemy. The helicopter too, I bet. Uh, you can't hide it. I'll do some sniffing around too. Good. Huh. That'll be a big help. Hi. Mm hmm. Mm. Hey, what the hell do you think you're doing sticking your nose in the boss's business? Uh oh. You head back and tell the others we found the rats and that we'll take care of them. Mm, got it, boss. Who are you? Uh, didn't you hear what I said? You're already taken care of. <laughs> Got it? I don't have to explain shit to someone who's about to die. Get them, boys. Looks like we're going to have to fight. You take half of them, and I'll take the other. Got it. Your luck ran out when you made the boss your enemy. Now you two can die together.
looks like that. Uh, ever seen these guys before? Some. Uh, for common misdemeanors, I'm pretty sh sure they worked under GG. If GG knows about us, then, uh, Marcus. It's from Marcus. Put it on the speaker so I can hear too. Got it. Hello? Hello? <laughs> uh, sorry, get out of there. Uh, Marcus, are you okay? Don't worry about me. Just get out of there. Garcia's with me. Uh, chasing Gigi at the club was just a trap to catch us. Even if the interpreter was... Ah! Marcus? Marcus! Now listen up, you idiots. Uh, is this Gigi? That's one of my aliases. Uh, what are you planning on doing with Marcus? Uh, we know you got Garcia, too. That's entirely up to you. If you t intend to keep snooping around, then you'll all be taking a trip to the bottom of the sea. But if you keep to yourselves, I'll let them go when the time is right. I'll let them go. Uh, we're not stupid. Someone as evil as you would never be so generous. Or gracious, my bad. I said generous. Uh, then do as you like. Uh, their fate is up to you. So don't forget. Click. Clicky! No. Uh -huh. I don't get it. What the hell is GG up to? I don't know what his goal is. But there's something else I don't get. Huh, the first person to call was Marcus. If Marcus was captured, how could he be free to use it, the phone? Uh, the only explanation is that GG had Marcus make the call to inform us that he was okay, I guess. He kept Marcus alive and even went out of his way to let us know. I'm pretty sure he wants to make a deal. And if that's the case, then he probably wasn't lying about his end of the bargain. You mean he'll let everyone go if we keep to ourselves? Exactly. And if he doesn't intend to keep them hostage or to kill you, it means he's got some kind of reason. What the hell is Gigi up to? I have a feeling if you do as he says <clears throat> and stay out of his business, you'll be allowed to return home safely. But you'll also miss your only chance to bring him down. Talk about a tough decision. It's out of my hands now, ultimately. This is uh, a decision that you will have to make. I want to get the criminal who killed my family. And I'm sure Marcus feels the same. I know if I go home just because the killer told me to, I'll regret it for the rest of my life. It's going to be dangerous. You sure you can handle it? I have to try. You're coming too, right? I'm not going to just up and leave. Not now. Uh, then it's settled. We'll go save Marcus and then uh, we'll arrest that murderer. Right. Uh, he's sure to be in that building Marcus was talking about. Just let me know when you're ready. I'll be waiting here. Got it. Let's do this. Let's do this. Bravo team, going dark. This is Delta Six. We're going in. This is it, I guess. Yep. Uh, I knew you showed up. You have no idea what you're getting yourselves into. If you're here, then this must be the right place. You sure about that? Either way. You're not going to live to find out. Bro, 
broke that arm of his. Don't you move. Hmm. Why would he say that to us after we beat his ass? Sorry. Well, we don't have time to talk. You're going to let us in. So you came. Hmm, you must be GG. No, the boss is already gone. What? He warned you, didn't he? He told you not to interfere any further. I'm going to take care of you now. You can die together, regretting your stupid mistake as one. Assassin, Gigi definitely isn't fooling around. Where is Gigi? Hmm? What is it? Uh, there's a note here on the phone. Tower, helipad. That time's written here too. I bet the tower refers to the Millennium Tower, the tallest building in Kamurocho, right? Uh, let's get going then. Wait, we still have a few hours until the time written on the note. If we get there first, they might see us and run away, and then we're back to square one. We should wait here first and make our move right before things go down. Okay. It's about time. Are you ready? As ever, let's go. That elevator should take us to the roof. Right, let's go. This is where it ends, folks. Who are these guys? Looks like they're... They were expecting us. I guess things are getting... Mother will recognize you.
Marcus Garcia, wait, isn't that... GG, I must give you credit for making it this far. However, your coming here was a mistake. And I take it you realize that now, no? It can't be. Are you sure that's GG? Yeah. Sorry. Huh, what's gotten into you? Can't blame you for being surprised. This is why I told you coming would be a mistake. What's going on? He's my brother. Your what? But why? It's just as it appears. I killed our parents, faked my death, and took off with our family's massive fortune. It can't be. I'm afraid it can. But the facts to report on the murder are all lies. What do you mean? Our family operated a plant dealing mainly with automobile manufacturing, but that business alone could never amass such wealth. It was merely a front. Behind the scenes, they dealt in the munitions industry selling arms. Huh, this was the true source of their enormous wealth. Wealth that I took. Publicizing my death freed me from the all political and economic responsibility. Leaving behind the scenes has many advantages. It can't be. Nobody can just fake their death that easily. Perhaps not in Japan. But the sleuthing techniques aren't so advanced where I'm from. It was hardly a challenge to find a loophole. And I'm rich. Nothing is impossible for me now. Uh, this guy's ridiculous. Uh, my parents and I never saw eye to eye when it came to their money. I had to get rid of them. But Nari and Marcus uh, were always there for me when I was alone. I am grateful to both of them. That's why you told them to stay out of your way, right? Uh, you didn't want to kill them. That's right. Even wicked people like you aren't able to forget the people they love. But do you think your friend and sister are happy with you now? That's why I told them not to interfere. If they figured out who I really was, I would have to dispose of them regardless. Dispose. You gave yourself away the moment you said that word. If these people were truly important to you, you'd never t uh, talk of disposing them. Not ever. I'm sure even Inari has realize the truth about you now. You're not my brother. My brother is nothing like you. My brother is dead. My brother died that day, along with my parents. You're just the criminal that murdered my family now, and you're not getting away with it. Ah, that's too bad. I would have thought you, of all people, would at least try to understand. You can't force ideas onto other people. I accept them to agree with that's enough. You will die now. I'm going to make you pay. Count on it. I grow tired of this banter. Prepare yourself.
Sounds like your final video. Oh, your video game. Oh, wait, he got a gun. Hold up. <laughs> he got a shotgun. Got him with the drop. This can't be. Give up. It's over for you. All I ever wanted was for you, just you, to be happy for me. If that's the way you truly feel, then pay for your sins with the rest of your life. That's my final wish, as your only family. Why did you kill your parents for money? You're the eldest son. You would have inherited the money either way, right? Those brainless idiots were wasting their own inheritance. How could I expect to inherit anything of my own? Waiting would have been futile. I tried reasoning with them. I even majored in management at college, but they would never even acknowledge what I was saying. They were so incompetent. They didn't even have the facilities to take notice of my talent. Uh, what's more, uh, they didn't trust me and were even looking for a new successor. They had no intention whatsoever to leave the family fortune to me and I. It is true that our parents weren't interested in anything but money, but you made the wrong decision. Nobody has the right to kill another. Ari, you've grown up to be a wonderful person. I can rest easy knowing that. Not a Morrison? I know. Ari, I know. This is Donna Moria from Community Safety Division. I need men on the roof of the Millennium Tower right away. Donna Moria, son. Thanks for everything. Really helped me a lot. I guess you were pretty shocked to find out the murder was really your brother. Well, of course. But honestly, I'm a little happy to see that he's still alive. Really? Well, we got the bad guy, uh, but I bet I'm going to be pretty busy for a while after this. Why is that? For starters, Gigi is going to be interrogated here in Japan, right? I also have to start on uh, extraction, pa uh, extradition paper, not extraction, paperwork. Oh, I see. So, the worst of all is this yet to come. Son of Moria, son, you're not going to help? Uh, I think I'll pass on that part. I wish you all the best, Ari. <laughs> hey, you can't leave me now. Just kidding. 
Eh, you were more help than I could have ever imagined. We'll take care of the rest. That would have been funny. Yeah, there has to be some way I can repay you. No worries. I was just doing my job. No more side quests, lol. <laughs> Plus, you taught me lots of new techniques. The whole experience was uh, pretty inspirational, too. Well, that's enough reward for me. Komaki firearm flip? He learned the Komaki style! Hey, yo! And he doesn't even know Komaki! You're too nice. Oh, when I get back home, I'll send you a bunch of fresh fruit. Uh, well, I am partial to fruit. I'll be looking forward to it then. Alright, come back. Come here. And help me fill these forms out. Hi. Be right there. Well, this is it. Tanamori-san. Thanks again. Right back at you. See you around. He learned the power of Komaki. Nari's training reward. Oh, have you completed all of Nari's training? Congratulations, you are worthy of the title Tamaro Chosen uh, Kumate Master. I have a prize for you. Come to Naomi's palace, the fortune teller at the south end of Tinkaichi Street. I'll give it to you there. Here we go. Oh, there's my own spells. Okay.
Welcome, welcome. What can Naomi's amazing psychic powers do for you today? I'm looking for a Filipina woman who uh, gone missing. Her name's not I. You say, huh, was she your sweetheart? You must let go of what is gone. Accepting the inevitable is simply part of life, young man. You going to help me or not? My friend Zell San over in the Little Asia said you have the power to see the unseen. <laughs> yes, but my services do not come cheap, Detective Tanamura. You know who I am. What sort of psychic would I be if I didn't at least know that Naomi sees all and knows all? Right. Okay, then. Do you know where uh, Nadian is? Uh, what are you doing? Silence. The great and powerful Naomi must concentrate. Yes. Yes. I see a name. Saki-chan. You should go ask Saki-chan. Saki-chan. She will give you the information you seek. You're not giving me the runaround, are you? <laughs> uh, you do not trust my powers? You can take your business elsewhere. Fine. Then just tell me where I can find Saki-chan. Near Pink Street. She'll be wearing a purple scarf. Thanks. Uh, if this goes well. You'll have yourself a new customer. <laughs> Come again. Uh, at the south end of the See what I got for you. Equipped all three sacred tree items to gain protection from bullets. I didn't know the clown was actually over here. I was wondering where the hell he was. Alright, since I don't have enough money with Sai, uh, to, for Saijima to do his stuff, I'm just gonna push the main quest. Time to finish this. I'm sure. We all got enough. They're all in their suits, in ties.
our Lord and Savior, John Moses Browning. What? <laughs> that was random. <laughs> John Moses Browning. Looked alright on him in Zero. Yeah. Well, that was because of uh, the funeral. お早い到着ですね。堂島会長。あ、いつ宗像と私の関係についてまでは知らないはずだ。もしそれを軌道に教えられる人がいるとすれば、それは大吾さん。あなただけです。そういうことか。あなたはわざと軌道を葛城に近づかせ、1000億のことを吹き込ませた。すで
それにお前もやってることは俺と大差ないはずだ口じゃ極道なんて言ってもお前がやってることは所詮警察の犬だろうがえ<笑>確かにそうだなそう言われても仕方ないもしかしてああ俺はな最初から極道なんかじゃないあの宗方が登場会を乗っ取るために送り込んだ潜入捜査員だったんだよ兄貴が刑事ああだがもう俺は違う俺は上司である宗方を裏切りこの手で殺した俺は大悟さんあんたとは違う俺は運命に抗ってでも自分の信じる正義を貫くこの金もその正義のために甘いな人間にはね千年以上前から決まっていることがある He got shot in the head. How is he alive? どの時代でも必ず使う側と使われる側の人間は決まっているということだ。服装かどうしてここに<笑>痛いだろう。だが死ぬほどじゃない。技術の進歩はすごいもんだよ。25年前とは格段に性能が違うそれはボート鎮圧用非殺傷弾つまりゴムスタン弾ってやつだまさか俺があんたを撃った時の拳銃はお前はこれで私を殺したつもりになっていたようだな<笑><笑>この爪の甘さが君の限界だよ新井君君に正義は実現できないそれに堂島さんあなたも同様だあなた程度の器では登場会という組織を支えるのは大変でしょうああそっちの君は一千億もの大金を偶然見つけて夢を見てしまったんだろう人間夢を見るのは悪くないそれくらいは許されることだ中田私の背後にいるのは私の忠実なしもべだ。君らはここで死ぬ。私の崇高な理想の邪魔になってはならないから。That money's gonna start flying away. <laughs>
Old man is about to beat the fuck out of this kid. <laughs> I was wondering if they flew it themselves. I was gonna say, yeah. <laughs> Wait, is he gonna become the new chairman? Please don't. Kiryu-san. いるじにしていった杉内さんや久井さんのためにも。さすがですね。秋山さん。ちょっと安心したよ。俺には人を見る目がないんじゃないかって疑心暗鬼になっていたんだけど。あんたはちゃんと野望を持った人間だったみたい
Hey, yo. This man thinks he's Kenshiro. I'm here to teach him that you ain't Kenshiro. Oh, you went back to blue. You know, what happened to the other police guard? Oh, he doesn't have a tattoo. Oh, hey, Karada Sturian, I guess. No, Aru Takawa Tsumio Kakusuchu Yatsuka. Akiyama san no Mise de Anokane Mitagi. Chance that I'm not done this. Sajima san only need to deny this car.極道のチャンスは一度きりだって。俺は今感じるんです。今がまさにその瞬間だってことを。そうか。なら俺がちゃんとお前の思い受け止めたるわ。しっかりお願いしますよ。ああ。手加減なし。
Dragon. I know this man's afraid. What the hell is that? Dragon. I don't even know what symbol that is on his back. Probably some significance. But that's a thing. It looks like a day. One that was on his back. They should have left Kiryu's fight for him. I guess they have their reasons. Anta ga mukashi, ore ni misete kureta yoni. A sign that symbolizes a dragon slayer. Yeah. Mata kou shite chokusetsu tadakaeru nanda. Omotte mo mimasen deshita. Demo shoujiki, kou shite tadakaeru koto ga ureshii desu yo, Kiryu san. Alright, time for R1 Triangle. <laughs> the game. Hey! I'm going to show you the diamond. I'm going to show you the diamond. I'm going to show you the would have been dope if they went through the glass as well. Oh, 
R1 triangle, R1 triangle, R1 triangle. Hold on. The timing's different. And for the people's elbow. He's like, I love you, man. We don't have to do this. <laughs> Damn. My R1 triangle. I can do that, did you? やっぱり。あなたは逮捕しません。自食させていただきます。服装か。クレックをさ、やおいうつもりだ。なあ、なんだこれ。ブロスの行動、逸脱してしまうかもしれないってことです。エブリッジブラザーズ、ブルーナップ
learning the way. <laughs> Me again, get the gutter. <laughs> the heat. back here.
Get that ass back here! You can't run forever!
of the pain in the air. No more running, old man. No more. You can't run. I'm gonna beat that ass. Bastard! Don't run away from me! You dumb slut! There you go. <laughs> One way or another, you were gonna get the drop kick of doom. <laughs> and then just drinking drugs during the fight. <laughs> He has real bullets. Those aren't <laughs> fake bullets. Hey, <clears throat> Kiryu has barely got a scratch on him. どうすべきではない。そうか。壮大はな。怖いですか。だがあなたが乗し上がるために多くの人の命を奪った罪はこんな恐怖だけで償うことはできない。あなたは死ぬべきじゃない。あなたが利用してきた刑務所の中で一生この罪を償ってください。私も一緒にお付き
こんなことで私が逮捕されると思っているのか何刑務所に送るだと私を誰だと思ってるんだ警視庁もそれも副総監だそんな人間が捕まることがあると思うのかえお前の犯罪行為は証明されてる確固たる証拠もあるんだなのにどうして逮捕できないバカだな現場も刑事ってな警察というのは正義だこの国の正義を司る崇高な組織だその警察の顔役たる私が逮捕されてみろバカな一般市民は混乱するだろうそんなことを警察が許すと思うかね<笑>権力者は権力によって守られるなぜかわかるかそれがこの国の秩序のためだからだ殺すなら今のうちだだが殺せばここにいる全員刑務所行きだそれでもいいのかさあどうするどうするえ<笑>結局お前たちがしたことは労力の無駄遣いだったということだ<笑>どうするしよう<笑>じゃあ本当にそうか試してみようか何ああ、俺だ。準備はできてるよし。じゃあやっちゃって。やっちゃって。ダジェンああ、いえ。Well, he is a journalist. Old man surrounded by shirtless men. I know this. <笑>そう。こんな話聞いてませんでしたよ。新聞社の活動に警視庁のヘリコプター使うなんて、何考えてるんですか。いいじゃねえか、国民のためだ。今さら家庭こと言ってんじゃねえ。さあ。Now, journalist papers drop. <laughs> Front page news, baby. That guy. I don't know how to do it. 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 Bullets. Once again, no blood came out. <laughs> Akiyama. Akiyama, sa. Kusa. Oi, Akiyama. Akiyama, daijoubu ka? Akiyama. Akiyama, sa. Oi, Akiyama. Doko wo utareta nda? Daijoubu ka? Yep. Who's <laughs> being dramatic? The stack of money. He took a whole bunch of stacks. <laughs> money. 
終わりにしましょう宗像さん救われちゃったよ<笑>やっぱすげえわあの人たちは。Shoot himself. Two weeks later, March 30th, 2010, Kamarot. Wait, is that who I think it is? Did she get skinny? There's Tanamoya. A death, a suicide. Or maybe a corruption case. Yep. <sighs> Self-delete. <laughs> さんでしたかあどうぞどうぞあすみませんここんとこずっと秘書の子がいなかったもんでダメなんですよね自分一人だと整理整頓もできないみたいで本当私がいないと何にもできないんですね社長はえっただいま秋山さん花ちゃんどうしたの花ちゃんそんなに寄せちゃって<笑>私も社長がそばにいないとダメみたいなんですずっとご飯が喉通らなくて<笑>社長私もう一回この店で雇ってもらってもいいですかあ、そうだ。ハンガイの特選焼肉弁当あるけど、食べる？うん。そろそろ花ちゃんが帰ってくるんじゃないかと思って買っておいたんだよ。そんな。I knew he was gonna do that. What an asshole. ちょっと綺麗になったねとか言ってくれてもいいじゃないですか。ああ、綺麗になったね。ダメ、全然実感がない。ああ。私が整理しておいた顧客名簿、どうしてこんなにぐちゃぐちゃになってんですかえー、なんでだろうもう社長、どうして私がいないとこうなっちゃうんですかねえ、花ちゃん、ベッドいくつ食べるたくさんあるけどえー、それじゃあ、行っていただきます<笑>
Zeit vor. So ga. Dade san mo moto no saya ni modoru nda na. Yamete kure yo sono iikata. Nanka mae no kami san to yori modosu mitai ni hikoru janai ka. Kami san mitai na mon daro. Eh. Anta ni totte no deka te shigoto wa. He's joining back. Ne. Omae no hoa dou suru da. Soro soro iku no ka. So da na. ちょっと。ああ、またな。I didn't think he would go back. He's like in his fifties. And probably damn near pushing sixty. <laughs> oh, I can't skip this at all. Oh, oh. Time to listen to epic music. <clears throat> I need to call my mother, I forgot. I was supposed to call her earlier, like around three. So I'm gonna do that while this plays in the background.
this is still not finished. I'm wondering what difficulty I should play Crisis on, because I beat them all on hard mode before. I don't know if I want to put myself through that pain in the ass stuff, though. Should I start up uh, Yakuza 5? Actually, no, I said I would start up Crisis earlier. Earlier, so I'll end up doing that uh, after this. <coughs> that have a slash through the L. Hmm. Uh, Goku. I guess his nickname is Goku because it's so hard to say his actual name. I hate how they like try to spread these out with like the last ones always. It's like, oh yeah. Oh, there was another cutscene. Alright. Uh. ちょっと長くなるかもしれない。大丈夫か？うん、待ってるよ。じゃあ行ってくる。ああ、he's oh, finally accepting that he's uh, leader of Tojo. Chairman.
登場会は俺たちの生きた証だああ力になってやってくれ直系西島組としてな任せろよ<笑><笑>